Well, welcome back this evening. It's a judgment-free event for young men of color to raise um, their concerns and hear solutions from community leaders. Now, part two of the Saving Our Sons Town Hall is scheduled to take place this Saturday. And joining us now is Pastor Bobby Manning with more. And welcome here to the program. Thank you for Thank having you. me. Absolutely. Well, tell us why this town hall is needed. Well, uh, I had the privilege of being involved in several town hall meetings that took place, of course, in recent events uh, called for us to, to talk and have action. One of the things that I noticed, however, was that we were talking all about our young men in our communities, but not really talking to our young men in the communities. So uh, so really, we wanted to create an event that was um, a safe place for our young men to um, not just sit and listen, um, but to participate in the dialogue and really share um, what are some of the things that they see, that we see from our own perspective, um, and a place that uh, that we can do so safely. And in light of some of the news events related to African Americans, people of color that have been happening, how important is this to be able to listen to those young folks? It's incredibly important because uh uh, th there's so much going on and there are so many uh, judgments being made about young men um, and we really don't get an opportunity to hear them speak. Um, I was uh, in the parking lot kind of telling a, young, a couple of young guys about the event and they had so much to say um, and it was amazing how much they really had on their heart that they wanted to express. Um, so uh, my hope for them was that, hey, come on to the forum where some of these community leaders that really can do something about uh, what you really feel and what you're really saying uh, can hear you and then you can we can create a dialogue it'll be an uncomfortable dialogue because it's in many cases the first time uh, many of our young men have had an opportunity to do it um, but it will be a, a dialogue that will bring about I believe um, some real solutions to, to the issues that we see when we turn on the news and now this is part two you had a part one tell yes. us how that went what kind of feedback did you get from participants it went incredibly well considering that it started to snow about 30 minutes before we started oh, no. <laughs> So, um, but even still, folks still came out. Um, we had a great uh, a panel there at that time, um, and I believe that this one be, will be um, uh, even better. Uh, we don't have to wear it's in the middle of August, so we don't have to worry about it <laughs> no snowing. Snow. Um, and I'm very excited about what we might see this coming Saturday. Okay. And um, you talked about solutions. Mm -hmm. I know we see a lot of dialogue, but right. what specifically will you do with the information exactly. and the solutions that they propose? I'm so glad you asked because a big part of the event is not just the forum but also the resources that we'll have at the forum we've partnered with several community organizations that will be there for the forum um, they will have resources available so if a, a young guy or a family comes and says well we need these resources I, I want to get off the streets I want to get a well-paying job I want to go to the next step in my education we'll have those resources there and available for them so that they not only leave having a, having had a good conversation but they'll be able to leave with the resources that will Will help them make the next step forward. We have less than 30 seconds. Tell us where this is taking place, when, and how to register. Yes, it will be at First Baptist Church of District Heights, which is in District Heights, Maryland, on Saturday, um, August the 8th at 12 o'clock noon. Um, and no registration necessary. Just show up. First come, first serve. We plan to pack it out and really have a great time. Well, I hope right. you do. It sounds incredible. Thank you yes. very much Thank for you, Pastor, Absolutely. for coming Thank out you. and chatting with My us. Pleasure. Okay. For more information on the Saving Our Sons Town Hall, here's where you can go, fbc dh.org. There you go.